assaulted and beat a young woman last week. Officers arrested the man from Jackson, Mississippi on Monday, who was in town for the Walworth County Fair this past weekend. Madeline Anderson joins us live with more on what happened this afternoon in court. Well, the judge ordered that the suspect be held on $1 million cash bond, referencing both the violent nature of the crime and the suspect's alleged plans to flee the area. Appearing in custody via video call, 24-year-old Terrence LaFleur remains silent and emotionless as the court discusses the evidence against him during Wednesday's bond hearing. The defendant's cell phone showed searches for Greyhound buses as well as for uh, information regarding the investigation in this case. LaFleur faces multiple charges, including first degree sexual assault, robbery, and aggravated battery. Elkhorn police say around 9 p.m. on August 28th, LaFleur attacked a 21 year old woman inside her vehicle as she was leaving work. He at first denied any knowledge of the assault, but later did tell law enforcement uh, that he used a hammer to strike the victim in the head in an effort to rob her, that he removed her clothes, uh, and that he sexually assaulted her. I can't believe that anybody could do that to anybody, especially her. A former classmate of the victim says she felt compelled to show support in the courtroom for her friend. She says the entire community is hurting. But I, I can't imagine how it would feel to be her actual family member. Prosecutors say LaFleur left the victim for dead. She suffered a skull fracture and was unconscious for several days. It wasn't clear whether or not the victim would survive, uh, but she did. And that victim is awake now and able to talk some. Meanwhile, the suspect is scheduled to be formally charged next Monday. Reporting live in Walworth County, Madeline Anderson, Fox 6 News. All right, Madeline, thank you for that update. A Burlington police sergeant is charged, accused of having sex with a woman.